welcome to its Rafiq. in today's video we are going to learn how we can draw XML tree to draw XML tree first we have to know the basic knowledge about the XML codes so in XML codes the first line is known as preprocessing instructions or processing instructions it's tell the browser that this document is an XML document on and how to handle with this document and after the processing instruction whatever tags come that tag is known as root element so this one in this xml code class 10 this is root element all the all other elements or tags are included or written inside this root element please remember one xml document can have only one root element so whatever element or tag come at top this tag is known as or this element is known as root element and element means at everything between on and off tag means the on on tag is this one class 10 and this one is class slash class 10 is off tag so whatever comes in between this all together known as element so here xml uh, class 10 is root element first to draw the tree we'll draw the root element and here after the root element this one is known as parent so here student will be parent means after class 10 will draw student and whatever comes under parent these are known as children like roll number name and marks and this one a v22 these are values of these children so let's see how to draw this tree first we'll draw the x uh, class 10 let's go to here so first we'll draw a rectangle box at top while you are drawing on page draw the rectangle bo box at uh, center position of your page so here we'll draw a rectangle box like this and on the box we'll write the element name it was class 10 so class 10 after this we'll draw the parent element and the parent element will be exactly at bottom of the root or exactly at the bottom of the root so here we'll draw the parent element our parent element is student means the class 10 is root so we'll draw class 10 at top after that student student is the parent element so inside the box we'll write student and we'll we will join these two boxes by using a line so we'll take uh, just we'll join these two boxes the line should be straight one as i'm drawing it on computer so it may be not perfect so try to do perfect okay after that we'll draw the children of student student have three children rule number name and marks and while you are drawing the children's all the ch children should be on equal level so from here i am going to draw the children here suppose roll number and here name and one more children will need this one is marks so here marks and we have to link the children by using a line so we'll draw a line first one will draw a line and will join the boxes by this and while you are drawing children these children should be in equal level not in one up one down and inside the children you will write the tag name and the values 
at top the tag name the tag name is rule and value is one so at top you will write rule and at bottom you will write the value so here rule and bottom the value value is 1 and in next box also here the tag name is name or name and value is the name of the student that's Avi and in the last box the value will be marks uh, the tag name is marks and value is I think uh, it's 22 so this way you can uh, draw an XML tree now suppose we have some changes in code the name have again two children first name and last name name have two children the first children is first name suppose first name is Abhi and one more children that is last name this one is Sarma now the name element doesn't have directly value it has some uh, two sub children so inside the name again we have to draw two boxes means the student children are roll number name and marks and name have again two more children they are first name and last name so you have to draw draw two more boxes in the tree for that what we'll do we will here remove the value will remove the value and uh, take name just will write the take name in the box or take name is name And inside name we are going to draw two more boxes for that uh, here one box for the first name and one more box here for last name and by using lines we'll join these two boxes by using line we will join the boxes and inside the box we will write the tag name and the value so we will write here first name f name and at bottom the value as a v And in second box again last name
and value is Sarma. So this way we can draw XML tree. To draw an XML tree, you have to remember the first things that uh, you have to identify the root element. Root element will be the first element which is just below the pre-processing instruction. You will draw that element first. After that, whatever comes after the root, that boxes you will draw after the root. And if there are children, you have to draw all the children in equal level, not one at top, one at bottom. And if the children have value, first you will write the tag name, like here, first name, and at bottom you will write the value. This way you can draw XML tree. In next video, I'm going to see, uh, show you some other XML trees. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video. Till, till then, take care and bye.